What's up guys and gals and welcome back to the fun little playthrough of Abandoned Ships Combat Demo which was made available to YouTubers and streamers and a bunch of other people just to get some hype drummed up for the game in the previous episode. We had murdered some guys. We had murdered some guys. We're pretty good at murdering dudes, all things considered, but we do have some murdery devices on here. We have fought five battles and one more battle we can go back to port. We've got 250 yet. We might as well. We might as well. Let's go to the local shops. I'm going to fix my ship. You will note that we took a little bit more damage right there, which is kind of horrifying. Low damage to hull sections, low damage to crew, but it caused a lot of hull cracks. That might be good. There's a flamethrower. There's the double shot. And so a short-range cannon that fires double the projectiles. The maximum range is close, though. And a lot of the ships that we're going up against in the future are going to be... They're going to be a little bit slippery and hard to get a hold of. So unless we were running double chain shot, I'm not confident we'd be able to close that gap. I don't think that's going to be a possibility. I could put the sailor in somebody else and I could swap that out for another chain shot maybe. Let's look at upgrades. So we've got a crow's nest. We've got a winch. Uh, we've already got the winch. We could take some hull armor. That'd be kind of badass. Let's take some hull armor. I like hull armor. Uh, where does this go? Ah, it goes right there. Perfect, we've got hull armor now, so we take 10% less damage from the uh, breakage of our enemies as they attempt to hurt us. I don't like being hurt, so I think that works out pretty well for me. We could put harpoons on here, but I don't really care about that. We can also buy supplies, but I don't think there's any point in doing so. Uh, I don't think it's been implemented in the game just yet. I wasted a bunch of money on supplies the first time I played the game, and I don't think once that it ever went down. Later on, when the game gets to its full release, you're going to be in charge of making sure everybody stays happy. There's going to be navigational maps and stuff like that. But for now, no big, no harm, no foul. I could go for that marine right there has pretty good piloting. We also have a gunner who's pretty good at piloting. We can't fit anybody else on the... I thought that guy's name was Smelly for a second. That's got to be a weak way to live your life where you're so stinky that people just name you based on your smell. No longer on, like, the aspects of your character that actively matter. But, you know, if you've ever been around a stinky person before, stinky people are hard to deal with, man. You ever had a conversation with somebody that just has, like, that overpowering BO? If you've worked in retail, I know you've done it. Don't lie to me. You have that dude or that lady who's just like, Oh my god, you smell so bad! And they keep asking questions, and they keep just like forcing you to be near them. Oh, it's the worst. It is the worst. I had a friend like that. I had to teach that fool. I had to teach him that taking a bath is necessary, because like his parents didn't care about cleanliness. Oddly enough, his parents didn't care about it. Like they didn't think cleanliness was an important thing. Uh, try to move closer to the enemy, please. Oh, we can move closer. Well then, give me some uh, Garipita shots. Go over here. Yep, you go over there. Captain, come over here to the grape of the shots. And then navigator, go do your thing. We're probably going to take, yeah, volley pretty soon. And we've already sprung a leak. What a day to be alive. You guys fire at their ship. Apparently they got the first shot off, which means they are better at shooting than we are. I don't like it when the enemy is better at shooting than I am. Go fix that place right there. We have a mortar. I am going to say fire the mortar right there. Luckily, at least they don't have any boarding people. Ow, he grape shooted me! Dick. I hate it when the enemy starts to use viable intelligent tactics. Fire the grape shot at them. Return fire. I don't want them to grape shot me anymore. Oh my god, that crack in the hole just will not go away. Uh, fire a mortar over there, please. There you go. Ooh, they must have the, uh, the hull buster cannons. That's what I'm thinking. Because they are breaking holes in me super gnarly. You go over and help. Uh, you're on the grape shot. I think this is just going to be a slugfest. You swap over to the acid bombs to force them to be places they don't want to be. Uh, you fix that hole right there. Navigator, go back to doing what you're doing. I will fire cannons at them. And then as soon as that's ready to go, I will drop an acid bomb right on the middle. Oh my god, I hate that cannon so much that busts holes in you. There we go. Force them back off that point. Sailor Jerry, make sure you take care of business on that side. And they are going to... Wow, that takes away a ton of health. That takes away a considerable volume. Their captain is dead, and their medic is getting there. That is why I like the acid bombs right there. They do a really good job. We've punched a hole in their hull, which is great. And if they want to fix it, put an acid mortar right there. Yup, don't let them fix a damn thing. And then what we're going to do is we are going to save until they go to the med station. Oof, that was quite a hit right there. All right, so there we go. Two more crew down. They are running out of crew right now. We are bleeding them for every ounce that they are worth. However, we have a lot of water on board. And so I would suggest that we maybe pump that out. Capitan, go back over there. Our ship has been struck by lightning. That sucks. I don't like it, but oh well. 
can't really be helped for right now. You go back over there. We've got an acid bomb. Fire that. They're not shooting grape shot anymore. So I'm not worried that much about casualties. It could happen. Don't get me wrong. Uh, you get ready for the inevitable. They're going to run over there and try to heal. Actually, they had two medics. It's no wonder we were struggling with knocking them down so much. Uh, he's pumped all the water out. Get back over here and fix the sails, please. The sails are not in good shape. Uh, push them off of that. He's putting out fires for right now. We have grape shot to right there. That's going to force them to run back to the medical area. He's going to die in acid fire. Great. I love it when my enemies die in acid fire. Go work on the fires. Is that somebody down right there? Can't really tell. I think his health is okay, though. I'm trying to fix the sails, but it's like, what are you going to do sometimes? So they're basically not functional anymore. They're trying really hard, but... They've only got a couple of crewmen, and they're not going to be able to summon up the resistance that it's going to require in order to knock our ship down. Our ship is kind of scary. Our ship is a bit of a badass. Uh, you know, he went to the, he puts the School of Hard Knocks as his alma mater on Facebook. All that kind of tough, st tough guy stuff. Every shirt that he has has references to like howling or like wolves on it. You know the guy that I'm talking about. Probably drives a Harley Davidson. That kind of stuff. Loves weather. He like he loves leather wear. That kind of thing. Probably has a beard of some kind. Probably rocks the do-rag. Uh, we'll knock that over to that side. And if you guys are going to go over like hell you are, I'm going to melt both you assholes. Yup. Have fun dying in acid. And there goes another medic. Although their ship is sinking, so it doesn't really matter. It was more of a spite action than anything else. I was shooting them to spite them, and the spite feels solid. Uh, I feel as though the spite was justified. Uh, sometimes you can't just let them sink. You gotta let them sink in just like a pool of blood. So at the same time they get eaten by sharks. It's like, no, shark, please don't eat my face. And the shark's like, nom 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 nom, shark hungry. Shark enjoy your face. Nom 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 nom. Uh, we can go to port. I don't think that's a good idea right now. We will go straight to the next battle. Black columns of smoke spew from nearby volcanic mountains, which are active. A distant boom will herald an eruption from one of these volcanoes. Shortly thereafter, a storm of rocks will fall across the battlefield. When the smaller rocks hit the ship, they start a fire. Larger rocks will cause hull cracks. Shit. That's the worst. Okay. Uh, you come over here. Navigator, go over there. Cannon guy, go over to the acid bombs. They have a lot of people. Uh, Capitan, go over to the Grape Shot. I'm hoping I can close the gap with them. I don't know how slow or how fast their ship is. They have so many medics! Oh my god, you get right there. You get right there. And hopefully we can just unleash a fusillade of pain on these guys. Not a fusil little pain, a fusillade. Uh, they've got a pretty nasty... They got a deck gun right there. I don't want to get hit by Grape Shot. So I'm going to try to melt them to the best of my ability. I'm going to wait till their health gets low. And we don't have targeting data over here. Fire in that direction. Uh, the acid is gone. Go ahead and do what you can on that side. As soon as that's good to go, put acid on their entire team. Put a mortar on their entire team. I don't want them to be able to recover from this situation. I want them to suffer. Like, I want them to sit over there this entire time with their health getting lower and lower. Oh my god, there are so many holes in my ship right now. Uh, I'm going to give that a set. Oh, shit. Okay, so you go over there. Take care of that. You fire over there. We've got crewmen down. Fire another one over there. And we got to get these holes out of our deck. Uh, you right there. Go fix that. Cannoneer, fix that. Uh, the more fixes we can get done, the better. I don't want to take on water right now. That does leave our acid cannon, like, woefully underutilized. But as much as I'd like to change that up, I can't. There's nothing. I have nothing right now. Uh, they're trying to fix holes in their deck. You go back to the acid gun. You go back to your cannons. Everything is fixed. Keep firing over there. That's another crewman down. Awesome. Keep shooting over there. I want as much damage over there as we can get. Sailor, get back on the motor. And this is why I like to have lots and lots and lots. I like to have withering fire. I like to have the kind of fire that they have no choice but to deal with. Uh, keep that over there. Acid bomb comes in. Have them melt a little bit. Kill off the remainder of the crew. And so there we are. Uh, they've got most of their characters down. We've got fires on deck. Fire that mortar, then we'll take care of the fires. Navigator, take care of that. Where's my other sailor at? Take care of that fire right there. As soon as that's out. I just want to keep them pinned on that side. Killing crew is going to be the best way we can get this done for right now. 
fire a shot at him. The captain is now down, and they don't really have a way to fight back at this point. They have no cannoneers. They have nothing else going on. Open fire on the main body of the ship. Don't let them repair anything. Uh, it looks like we got mostly lucky right there. I thought that was going to hurt a lot more than it did, but we're all right. As soon as he gets the fire out, keep shooting. Uh, he's going to lose a little bit of health because he's too near a fire. Oh, never mind. we got a hole right there, too. I'm going to need somebody to pump the water up out of this thing. Uh, put acid on him. I think their ship will sink from water being on board before anything else happens. I don't think that acid is being entirely effective right now. I don't think it's being effective at all. There's another hole. They're taking on water. I don't think I've ever sunk a ship with with water before, so this might be kind of interesting. There are a lot of holes. Uh, you go ahead and pump some of the water out. Sailor, get back over here and get rid of that hole. And we are pumping it out a little bit faster than it's coming on board. He's trying to pump it out right there. Keep shooting. Uh, he's almost down. And put acid on one of them to force them away from the pumps. I want to see what happens if the ship sinks from water. And so if we can melt a couple people over here, that'd be great. Our cannons are a little busted up. Put the navigator back over there. And with the grape shot fire, I just want to kill everybody on board. If I could do that... Oh, I can't get a shot off on both of them. Okay, we'll fire a shot over there. He's got too many holes in the deck to really do anything else anyways. Uh, put acid on him. And it behooves us to get this fight done as fast as possible. Because there are legitimately... Your crew returns from the enemy's vessel. Oh, really? If you kill everybody on deck, it looks like you get actual bonus loot. And so if you don't sink the ship, you get way more stuff. Nice. So that was a little bit more difficult, but I think between the acid shots and everything else, we did a great job right there. Uh, let's go to port. We want to see what's available for upgrades. We got the suppress and swivel gun. Knocks enemy down and is only good at close range. We got sniper fire. We got the sure shot and the ship smasher. I may... Swap out the normal mortar for the ship smasher. It sounds awesome. It's called a ship smasher. What's not to like about that? We can get automatic water pumps and automatic winches. Let's go for the automatic winch. So there we go. That'll pull my crew out of the water by default so that nobody has to go do that now. And it saves us a set of working hands if somebody gets knocked overboard. Let's sail back to sea. We got another battle going. Three more in front of us. Oh, I forgot to repair my ship. Hmm. That might not go well. I forgot to repair my shiz diggity swa. Okay, so you guys go over there. Gunner. 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 And gunner. I just want a whole bunch of people. Try to pull closer. Uh, cannoneer. I've got a lot of mortars, so it's not that big of a problem. Go back over here and start firing chain shot at these cats. Uh, my assumption is that they're going to run snipers against us since they're trying to stay further away. And so we'll fire chain shot back over. We'll try to tear up their sails a little bit. We got a mortar ready to go. Yeah, drop a mortar right there. See what kind of pain we can cause. Uh, open fire just on the general areas of their ship. I don't really care if you... Oh, a guy fell overboard. Damn. Oh, yeah, that was, from our, that was from our check right there. I forgot about that. We're writing checks right now. Uh, we are pulling in a little bit closer. Shoot their sails to keep that pulling closer thing happening even more. Uh, we've got fires all over the place, and they've boarded us with a nasty little scum monster over here. Go and fight him. Get him up and out of my face. Keep the, keep the crasher going. They should be able to kill the boarding guy pretty quickly. You go over there. Take over on the mortar. That thing is now dead. We've got cannons still firing. Fire at their sails, please. I would like to be closer. Uh, they've got enough crew right now to where I think they're going to do a pretty good job of pinning us down. Get that sniper off of me. I'm not a fan of snipers. They are the worst. You swap over to right there. Uh, we've got a fire on deck. So you fire one more chain shot and then go deal with the fire. They are taking acid damage, which is fantastic. I'm close enough now to where I can get grape shot on them. So I'm going to focus on that. Uh, I think they're more than likely going to try and pull back away from us. They don't like to be up close if they can help it. But since they've got everybody right there, 
We're going to try and soften them up a little bit. We've already knocked a hole in the ship, and if they want to fix it, they've got to take damage. So that was definitely an asshole move on my part. But well orchestrated, if nothing else. Keep shooting. There it is. A lot of them are going to evacuate back towards the crew area. we got no holes in our deck right now, which is good. I'm going to put a mortar right there. Uh, i got to click this little button down here. Hold on. Everyone brace for impact. Hopefully we don't lose anybody overboard right now. As you can see, it knocks down our entire crew. I don't see anybody in the water right now. So we should be all right. Fire over there. That's one crew member down. Go ahead and melt the medic next. Perfect. Fire the mortar back over to that side. Keep them thinking. If I can keep that health ticking downwards. Oh, good. They failed their brace for impact test, too. Keep firing at them. Uh, their crew is definitely looking a little bit harried right now. And not just because they never shave. I know beards are popular on the open sea, but that's not the kind of hairy that I'm talking about. Put another one over there. Put another one over there. And then... Ah, they all ran away. I think he's maybe... No, he's not down. I think he's just wounded. They're trying to fix holes in their deck right now, so they're not going to be able to return fire anytime soon. That's a really good gun right there. I'm surprised how good that gun is. Just forcing them to brace for impact or fall over all the time, that's pretty good. There we go. Nope, nobody's fixing that hole today. You thought somebody was fixing that hole. You were wrong. A little bit more damage on that side. Blow another hole in them. Yep. Yo ho, blow the man down. That song always had like a vaguely sexual connotation to me. I don't know, maybe I'm just sick though. Fire that and then brace. We are braced. Continue firing. If you don't click the brace thing, instead of them being stunned in spot for like a couple seconds, instead what ends up happening is they actually get knocked overboard like you saw happen with them. If we can time it right, we can force them to make a double brace check. Uh, right around the time so we can fire the mortar right when the wave comes in that might actually knock somebody down And if they're already knocked down, I think it sweeps them off the deck, too And so there is strategy to this game. There's actually a surprising amount of meta that you can play around with uh, They have valuables odd trinkets and exotic looking cloth. They might smell a little odd, but they'll fetch a decent price Sounds good to me uh, We have fought eight battles and there are two to go I'm gonna return to port and fix my hull I'm terrified of what's going to happen if I don't fix my hull. We've got round shot over here. I don't really care about that. We've got sniper rounds. Snipers would be cool. I don't know. It's 100. And this is basically our last ride right here. So... Yeah. Instead of grape shot, let's try the sniper out. I've never used the sniper before. So we'll use that to maybe focus fire people and kill them a little bit faster. We will look at the upgrades, although I doubt we're going to be able to afford anything. We have harpoons right there. Okay. Yeah, put harpoons on here. We're on the last fight, so we might as well get as much cool utility stuff as we possibly can. Solid chunks of ice permeate the waters. When they hit your hull, they will cause damage. By purchasing an icebreaker, you can protect your ship. So I should have bought that. That was dumb of me. But it can't be helped now. You guys jump onto everything you can. I don't know if they're going to be trying to be closer or further away. I don't really care either. Um, you load that. You go over here and start working on the snipey fire. I want this enemy to hurt. I want them to hurt badly. We are taking a lot of damage from that. I wonder how the last fight's going to go. I've never actually made it to the last fight. This is the first time that my loadout was solid enough to where... I got to the first or to the final fight. So there it is. We've got that covered. You guys open fire on the side of their ship, just wherever. Don't even really care. We're already causing damage. As soon as the sniper is good to go, uh, fire at him and knock him down. We've already killed a guy. Oh, he's down. Go pick him up, please. And we've got a lot of holes in our hole. Wow, that did not go well. Okay, put some acid on him right there. Keep him thinking. Keep him guessing. Keep him wishing. And as soon as that sniper rifle's back up, we're going to try and knock somebody else down. You go over there and fix that hole. Oof, sniper rifle out right there. And you fire at him. Put acid on that side of the deck. Captain, go back to the mortar, please. You go back to navigating. Oh, we got another hole right there. Never mind. You go back to doing what it is that you're doing. 
We still have a man down right there. He shouldn't be down. I thought we picked his ass up. Well, it looks like we have a man down. So that mortar is ready to go. Keep firing on that side. Keep firing on that side. There we go. Uh, navigator, get on the cannon. Uh, we don't have a choice. They're not trying to get away from us anyway, so who cares? Uh, their navigator is down. We just sniped him. So this is a fight where we're actually... I think he's down for the rest of the fight, but he's not dead permanently. Uh, fire another acid mortar over to there. Fire that over to there. And we are sitting on pretty bad health right now. We are winning. We can say that. We are winning, but not by a lot. I don't think the next battle is going to last a very long time if we don't manage to pull out of this thing. Uh, put another acid bomb over there. Fire at him. So there it is. He should go down in just a minute, unless he's just got the HP of a tank. Uh, go ahead and heal yourself up. We fix that hole. Get back on the cannon. I don't see any further holes. Keep putting acid on him. We do have a hole right there. God, those icebergs cause crazy damage. Definitely want an icebreaker in the future. A little bit of a thing to introduce one person to another. Make sure we're all on the same team here. Uh, that cannoneer is not doing what he's supposed to be doing. I think that'll be loaded in just a minute. Alright, that's another one right there. You... Put a mortar shot right there. Put a mortar shot right there. And then fix that hole in the deck. It's gonna be okay, everybody. It's gonna be okay. And so if we can melt these guys, that's all that I want for right now. It doesn't look like they're dying, though. I wish they were, but they aren't. Mm. Die faster, you plebs. There it is. I think I just sniped their marine. I think their marine's down. I'm actually, I'm interested in seeing what this final battle is going to look like. I've never been able to make it to the final battle. This time around, we got really good cash money, and so I'm excited about this. Fire that over there, then fix the hole in the deck. Fire a little bit more acid at them, and that should be it for them. We've managed to take out ships that are way bigger and beefier than we are, and so I'm proud. I actually, the first couple times I played the demo, I felt like it was really, really, really difficult. Although I've had time now to lock in on which weapons are the ones that seem to work best in tandem with one another and handle their business. Uh, what's the final battle? Your ship is ensconced in darkness, driving rain, wind, and sea spray. Titanic waves speed towards you. Rain will turn out fires, whereas the tidal waves will do a bracing test. Okay, so sailor over there. Captain on the mortar. We probably aren't going to walk away from this one. Fair warning. But doesn't mean I'm not going to try. Get somebody on the sniper rifle. You guys begin firing right now. If they want to fight from a long range, actually, I'm okay with that. Uh, I don't care. Everything I have is long range. So I might as well. Hopefully they don't send too many borders over. If they do, that'll be a little bit weak, but... Yeah, shoot at their cannoneers. Why not? Uh, put an acid mortar right there, because I know they're trying to fix their ship right now. And I'm not okay with that. You guys get over here and fix the holes in the deck. Keep on shooting as much as possible. You get back to your previous job. And with the sniper, I'm going to try and drop whoever I can. Like, if I see them over there and they're at the medical station, that's good. Oh, somebody fell off. Yay! One of their guys fell overboard. Fantastic. One less crewman makes me a happy camper. Uh, fire whatever you need to fire over there. Sniper's all good to go. Get that cannoneer. I think he's down. I can't tell, though. We're too far. Nope, he's still moving. He's still moving. Keep firing mortars at him. Uh, we have borders over here. Uh, get up in there and help. Oh my god, we have so many borders. Uh, everybody fight. Everybody fight. But that is going to be a large portion of their crew, like, gone. Uh, you guys kill them off. We will stabilize him. Oh, they put an acid bomb on us. Dicks. Okay, get away. Get away. Until you go back over here. You guys fall back. Go over here. Get as many of the crew off to that side. They're playing the exact same strategy against me that I played against them. Oh, he's dead. Brace for impact. What else could go wrong? All right. Uh, you get on cannons. You guys get health back. You get back on that sniper over there and pay them a lesson. Shoot him. 
cannoneers get on the acid guns and you get back on your cannon spot. I want them to suffer a little bit for the pain and anguish they've caused me. Uh, put the mortar right there. Put the mortar right there. We are losing slightly right now. We are losing slightly, but we may be able to pull through. Uh, nothing is certain in this game. We aren't taking nearly as much damage as I expected to take. And so as long as we can keep the pressure on him, I think we'll be all right. Uh, you shoot him. Put acid right there while he tries to winch in his compatriots. Perfect. Uh, we don't have anybody firing the mortar right now either. And I think the only thing that's going to pull us through here is trying to guarantee we stay at long range. Uh, guarantee that we keep bombardment going. Because that's going to be a major fixture of our strategy here. As soon as that's loaded, hit whoever you can. I don't even care. Just drop as many of their crew as possible. I do not want them to be alive. There it is. Acid bomb to there. Keep them pinned down on the med bay as much as possible. So there's the acid bomb on the med bay, and if we get really lucky, I'll be able to snipe somebody right there. We're knocking people overboard left and right, which is the only reason why we're doing so well right now. Uh, we keep knocking them. Oh, brace for impact. Everybody brace! It's a wave, and it's coming in! Hold fast, ye scurvy dogs! All right, so we held fast, ye scurvy dogs. And put another one over there. Make them hurt a little bit. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. I'm thinking borders were like their only chance. I don't know if I dropped that guy right there, but I sincerely hope that I did. I don't think I did. I think we're going to have to stay on him. We are going to have to stay on him. We might actually win this. Surprisingly enough, we've killed most of their crew. Uh, their crew's in bad shape right now. Really bad shape. Their crew has absolutely had better days. They're trying to plug up a hole right there, I think. So go ahead and punish them for that. Shoot the captain. Oh, we killed the captain. Hell yeah. Very, very nice. Keep going. Launch that mortar right there. And really, this game entirely, the strategy seems to be keep the enemy pinned and working on shit other than shooting at you. If you can do that, you will win. Even if you start with very little health, you'll be able to pull through. As long as you can keep it so that they can't get the things done they need to do. So, for example, putting acid on their med stations when they're trying to heal. Putting acid on their winches when they're trying to pull people back in. They can't really do much else. We did it! Oh my god, I've never beaten the game before. I've played this like six times, and this is the first time I've made it. Hell yeah, we're the best! This game is called Abandoned Ship. I hope you guys have liked it so far. I really think this game is going to be a bang-up success. Uh, look for the link down below if you wanted to get the game yourself. But aside from that, I think that's the end of the combat demo. Yeah, there it is. Abandoned Ship. If you like this video, hit the like button down below. It's the best way to support me. Uh, if you wanted to support me further, check out the Patreon. If you wanted to hang out live, go to twitch.tv slash splattercatgaming. I will see you all later. How do you do, everybody?